guys, so today I'm going to be doing a first impression on the Claire's Illuminating Supple Blemish Cream. <laughs> um, has SPF 40 and wrinkle care, whitening, and sebum control. So I'm really excited to try this out. I actually won this in a giveaway from Hey It's Bay, and I was so excited, and I got it today, and I can't wait to try it out. I was going to do it when I go to work, but, yeah, I, me filming at like 4 o'clock in the morning to get up to go to work, I don't know if that'll work, but, um, I'm going to run some errands and do a whole bunch of stuff today, so I wanted to see how this held up. So, I didn't put, I don't have any face makeup on, and I don't have any base or anything like that. I do have my eyes done, which will be in a tutorial. If I have it up already, I'll link it up here, but if not, it will be linked up here when it's due. Um, but yeah, so, it comes in this really, really cute box. Um, it has 40 milliliters, so that's awesome. It says, apply after basic skincare routine, blend evenly with fingertips, and gent patly into the skin. Okay. So, it comes in a really cool skeezy tube, and I'm going to try it out. It has a little elf care. I'm going to use my hands. I just washed my hands. Um, so, let's... Ooh, there's a lot of air in there. Okay. Okay. So, I'm just gonna start applying it on my face. Ooh, it smells really good. Kinda has like a lemony scent to it, I wanna say. Mmm. It's definitely covering the redness that I have. Not so much the uh, blemishes I have. But, you know, as long as that redness is gone, they don't look like Rudolph had a party on my face. Okay. I try not to put too much on my forehead because my hair just kind of gets in the way sometimes. Alright, and that's one layer. Um, pretty much all my redness is covered. I still have a little bit of my acne showing. Let me see if I can go over it um, a little bit more. Oh yeah. Okay, so the coverage is buildable, which I really like, um, in case, you know, my face decides to freak out, again, like it always does, um, I don't have to worry about that, so that's good, um, it has really good coverage, I really like how it reduces the red, because, especially when I'm at work, that's like the one thing that, like, bright, um, <laughs> Uh, I really do like it though and it has like a matte finish it's not dewy which I really like I like the more matte um, finish even though I think it said illuminating I don't really see much illuminating but I really do like like it okay so it is 401 let me show you guys if I can I don't know if my phone will <laughs> share you guys, but it's 401, and I am going on some errands, and I will check back in in a few hours, and, uh, yeah. Hey guys, so I'm back, um, it is currently, let's see what time it is. 12.36 a.m. Um, 
so I've worn the foundation for about eight hours now. Well, the BB cream. Um, and I have to say, I really like how it held up. So I went and ran a bunch of errands and did a bunch of stuff. Um, I have to kind of be quiet because I'm ready to sleep right now. But I'm going to go ahead and talk about the BB cream. So I really like how it wore. Um, my face feels really nice. It didn't get tacky or gross over the period of time that I wore it. Um, I did a lot of running around, so it definitely held up to all of that. Um, I do see a little bit of my acne showing through. Um, most of the redness is still covered except around my nose because I've been blowing my nose like crazy lately. I'm not sure why, but yeah. Um, but I really like how it held up. I think it would, I think it would hold up a lot better if I had some sort of primer on or, you know, added a concealer or maybe powdered it. Um, but for on its own, it did really well and I'm really impressed with it and very happy with how it wore. Um, when I realized when I was like, this is probably TMI, TMI. But when I was blowing my nose, like, none of it transferred onto the tissue, which was really good, because I have that problem happen a lot with, like, foundations and really anything that I put on my face. So I really, really like that, that it was uh, transfer resistant. Um, I know I touched my face a lot just because habit, I guess. Um, and I took off my lashes because they were bugging the hell out of me. So I ripped those things off. Um, but yeah, I have to say it's really awesome. I really, really enjoy this PB cream. Um, and I'm excited to wear it more. And so special thank you to Hey It's Play for having the amazing contest that she had. Um, you're awesome and amazing. Um, yay. <laughs> um, so I really hope you guys enjoyed this review. And if you have any more questions about the BB cream, um, let me know in the comments below. I'm going to put below where you can buy the BB cream on wishtrend.com. Um, that's where the BB cream came from, so I'll definitely have that link below. And you should check it out because it's pretty awesome. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like these kinds of videos, let me know in the comments below and give me a thumbs up. And if you like my channel, please subscribe. It means the world to me, and it's free. <laughs> so, I hope you guys all have a great day. I'm going to go wash all my makeup off, pass out, yeah, and then wake up early. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Anyways, I'll talk to all of you guys later. Bye.